Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, Anna Maria Mule. I'm making dinner now, my work day is done, and today I decided to make a nice um, pasta, and I'm using some spaghetti alla chitarra, which were some noodles, um, some spaghetti that I picked up at the supermarket. Um, they're fresh, they're packaged, I'm gonna make that in a pink sauce pink tomato sauce with prosciutto and peat. So the way I'm starting it out is I've added a little bit of garlic and onion. And I'm gonna let the uh, cook down for a few minutes in a little olive oil. And it's gonna, uh, it smells great in here. And then I'm going to add some prosciutto and once that cooks, some tomato sauce and some peas and let it all come together. In the meantime, my water is, is uh, on the stove top for the cover and hopefully it will boil soon, but I'm going to wait till the sauce is almost done before um, I put my pasta in because that pasta cooks very quickly. I got a pretty fine chop on this, and then I want big pieces of the sauce. Okay, now I'm going to add my prosciutto. This is just cute prosciutto for the supermarket. It's already cute. Ready to go. And this is going to cook for about five. You start it here again. Yeah. Sure. And I get a chance uh, to all kind of cook together. But without having anything burned. Okay, I'll be back in a few minutes. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Please subscribe, please like. Okay, it's been on for about three minutes. I'm gonna let it cook another minute. Let's see. It's really good. You taste it. Really, that nice taste of the prosciutto little smoky, even though it's not smoky, but it feels like it's a little smoky. Okay, it's been about four minutes. Now I'm going to add the tomato sauce. I'm going to add my cream. We've got about a cup of cream here. So it turns into a nice egg sauce. Forget to give it a good stir, and I raise the heat a little bit. And I'm gonna let this cook for a while 10 15 minutes until it all comes together. But you can see, nice pink sauce, really easy, great flavor. Uh, I might add a little salt just because um, I did eat, add quite a bit of cream, the cream is sweet. Salt there. Give it a little 
gonna stir. And I'm definitely gonna add some pepper in a little bit and then I'll taste it to see if it needs a little bit more salt. It might not, um, but that's it. All there is to it. Really simple, I mean, come on. You can have anyone come over and treat them to this. Okay, so as you can see, it's coming up to a boil. It's been cooking for about five, 10 minutes. So I'm gonna um, put it on a lower flame and I'm gonna let it cook at least another 10 minutes. It's still pretty, uh, pretty loosey and I want it to thicken up some. But I added, I tasted it and I added some uh, black pepper. And I add a little salt, so it's really to taste. You can also add a little red pepper flakes, but it's really to taste. I tasted it and it definitely needed a little salt and a little pepper, and so I added it. So, so far it's been cooking about 10 minutes. I just lowered the flame, so I'm gonna let it simmer away for another 10 minutes, and then I'm gonna check it. And at that point, it should be ready to go. to the consistency I like. I had it just on the simmer. You can keep it going as long as you want. And then I cooked up my pasta. Pasta was ready. Now normally I would just throw all the pasta into the sauce, but my kids, they like it plain. Um, so I kept it separate and I did make a plate for myself, which I'm gonna show you now in a second. There it goes. I got my plate. I've got my nice prosciutto, my pizzelli. I'm gonna add a little cheese. And there you go. Spaghetti with prosciutto, peas, in a pink tomato sauce with a little bit of cream. Enjoy. Hope you try it and enjoy. If you like this recipe and you like the recipes on my channel, please like this video and please subscribe. Have a great day. Mm -hmm.